Right. Howdy, you guys. Welcome back. When I say they had the house to be sold on the 15th. Man, that's what I mean. That's why I'm on your ass. I mean, you just said that you had to be out by the 15th of next month. Your house was sold enough and you had to be out. Period. Okay. Okay. So, Dad, have you heard a head gasket giving him the problems he's having with, with depression? And, well, yeah, I have a head gasket. Or not a head gasket, an intake gasket. The intake gasket ain't got nothing to do with depression. Not a damn thing to do with depression, period. It doesn't That's have why this car's not running. Not a damn thing. Now look at okay, this yard. Okay, folks, we finally figured it out. Well, at least I did. Look at this yard, you guys. Um, remember, we had the guy come here, put the starter in. We had the other guy do the valve adjustment to zero lash. There's nobody going to okay, buy that house. Well, like that. Period. Everybody is thinking it's a wiped uh, lobe or whatever on the cam, and, you know, things are pushed down or tightened down too far. Well, the guy said that all of them were loose. So there was no white lobe on the cam. What the actual problem is here. You don't have a fucking clue. I told you what the fucking problem is. You don't want to hear it. It's none other than the intake the manifold. You don't want to hear the problem, Rich. Smoke is coming out all around it. And if you think I'm lying, watch when I crank it. I'll put some starter flow in it. Just in case it does decide to fire. Look at this, you guys. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Okay, now what it does is it smokes all around the intake. That's what it's doing. Smoke is coming. Yeah, you got anything else going on? Uh, brother? He's, he's insane. He's fucking nuts. You haven't talked about Swamp Lock Series for how long? A long time, buddy. Years. Many, many, many months. You ever heard of an intake guy that calls him that? Not that, no. I mean. Rich, you're full of shit. If the intake gasket was blown, and from all it around would light off. It was still light intake off. manifold. More than likely, so, and run wide open. Whatever it's heating up inside like is escaping right through the sides. I, mean, I think it may need another fuel, set of gaskets. You would think intake you manifold are. gaskets, not head gaskets. You are out of your fucking mind, Rich. Go ahead and waste your money. Waste it. That's the problem. It's the only thing I can come up with. Because the uh, the lobes are not wiped. Uh, they never no, were wiped. They're not. They were always loose. The valves were always tight. loose. They were never too tight. Oh, bullshit. And the, the distributor is not that big of a deal to straighten out, to figure out, you know? Right, take um, the job. I think that if he actually had it 180 degrees out, well, hell, I'd be able to find that out very easily by taking a screwdriver. What do you mean? If he had it 180 out, turning it would the be fan bucking. by hand. It'd be bucking. Until it puts pressure on the screwdriver. Or, 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 you know, it's not even bucking, man. And you take it out. I mean, you are so nuts. And uh, you, so you poke the side of it. Lightly, of course. You're not going to jab oh, at it like wow. a knife. And see if the piston came up. If the piston came up, and your... Um, Harmonic balancer is at top dead center or close to it. Well, then your distributor's rotor should be pointed at number one. You're forgetting about compression stroke, buddy. You gotta that should be it. Yeah. Well, I'm not gonna crank red. it anymore because the battery is dying out. I gotta put it on the charge again. I, mean, you got I didn't see where that takes us. That that but I know the car will run. It's not that. It's not that complicated. You know, like not like that big of a problem. And if it's not that, it's got to be the timing or the gas for the carburetor or the carburetor's got a lot of vacuum leaks. I have no idea after that. More excuses. You know, those are the only things that you really would check out. Bullshit. It ain't got no compression. Where else are you going to have a problem? It's getting it gas. No it's getting spark. Dude. We know that. 
and apparently it's getting way too much Zip. air, so. Zip. That would be the problem. All right, folks, like and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one. Can't wait. I'm glad somebody figured it out. Nope, nobody ever figured shit out. Look at this short though. That's what I mean. Real dope. But if somebody's gonna buy the house, they're gonna take it just like that, huh? I mean, come on, you got three hundred thousand dollars out of a house in the yard like that. That's what I've been saying this whole time. There is no fucking. Damn, way. Richville, you're None. weird. Your Zero. son left that Zero. shit sitting Nine. there. Your stepson been gone for how many years? And shit, looks like you found some sockets and shit. Now you threw over the yard, which you called bullshit on. Because that other guy didn't know. Well, what you the called bullshit on either. Yeah, no clue. Keep throwing money out there, Barry. I mean, I mean, don't, don't. I mean, run compression on it, Rich. See what's your game. Get a real compression filter. Harbor Freight, twenty dollars, dude. Sorry, guys. I mean, twenty fucking dollars, Rich. My boy likes He-Man, so that's why I came on. Plus, I like He-Man. Sue me. I mean, shit. And I mean, like, when when are you actually going to, you know, want to enjoy this car? I mean, Get one that screws in the holes with the hose that snaps on. Fuck, man. If I had an extra one, I would send you one just so you could run a compression on a motherfucker, dude. So we could laugh when it fucking does not that. How much is one of Harbor Freight, dude? I mean, I don't know. 30, 40 bucks, maybe? 40 of that? Jesus yeah, Christ, like 30, dude. Hey, Dad, don't forget, man. He's going to be in stocks and bonds. He is. He is. Not in draw disability, you ain't. You're not gonna have a bunch of CDs and investments and shit and draw disability, Rick. Because right now that's what you have to draw is disability. You are not old enough to draw weapons on security. You have to draw some shape of disability, buddy. And the fact of the matter is, you can't have a bunch of money in the bank to draw disability. Fuck, you can't even own more than two cars, man. I mean, yeah. so what? 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 So. Now we're gonna some Barry content. Um, Mako did their live, you guys know, go check that out, go check that out. We were busy in town, and my son was actually watching He-Man. We had a hell of a day. Yeah, I mean. Fucking brake lines blew on a truck, over rusty after 350,000 miles, I'm sure they were rusty. One of them busted, then the shit takes off in the, in the, in the vet, we gotta make sure the tire was all the way up. Oh, this has been a hell of a night. Blew one completely off the rim. Blew a fucking 200 some dollar tire off the rim. Uh, it's been a hell of a night, hell of a night, hell of a night, but it's ending pretty good, so. Yeah, we get to make fun of you guys, really, so, really woohoo!